just what I was asking you before, just uh, when did you find out that uh, they wanted you to be the parade marshal for this? Oh, about a week ago. My dad came up to me and uh, said that I need to go call the mayor. And so uh, I called the mayor and he asked me if I wanted to uh, be the grand marshal. Of course, I was on. Yeah, I was going to say, what what went through your mind? I mean, have you ever, you know, have you ever been a grand marshal of anything before? A parade no, before? this is definitely a first. So, uh, it, it did was there a sense of pride to that? Folks recognizing the service and M most definitely, most definitely. Um, I love what I do, but uh, in that same aspect, I'm not the only one that does what I do. There are uh, millions like me. Is so, it uh, a sense of you represented everyone in the, particularly in the army, but. Uh, out there today, everyone in the military services? Um, I do my best to, uh, I do my best to, um, do my job the best. I can't say about everybody else. Um, I'm sure, uh, me personally, I, I joined, uh, because I love this country and I wanted to serve my country. Uh, uh, tell us a little bit about your, how long you've been in the service now. I've been in two and a half years. Um, Enlisted in December of 2006 and started boot camp uh, January of 2007 and uh, loved every minute of it. Tell folks, 10th uh, 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 Mountain, is that right? Uh, no, 82nd Airborne. Oh, 82nd Airborne, okay. I jump out of airplanes. <laughs> jump out of airplanes for a living now. So now, uh, uh, you know, what? where all have you served so far? Uh, I've been stateside the entire time. Okay. I've been to uh, Alabama. Uh, Florida, but mostly in North Carolina. And now you're getting back, heading back to North Carolina here pretty soon, aren't you? Pretty soon. Yep. Uh, how long were you home for the holiday? At least when you got through the holiday, how long have you been home here? Uh, I've been home for two weeks, and it's been awesome. Uh, Tech City is a great place to grow up. Um, there's a country song called Small Town USA, and uh, it reminds me a lot of home. Uh, you're heading back to Fort Bragg. Do you expect to stay stateside, or... Uh, any chance uh, you make? I have an upcoming deployment. Where are you headed? I'm headed to Afghanistan. And we got your uh, your dad here. He's pretty proud, I would say. So, uh, Captain, what was it like for you to have, one, just your son serving in the military? Uh, we're very proud. He represents our city, our county, our state, and most of all our country. Uh, what would you think, though, when the mayor called you up and said, hey, we want Joseph to be our parade marshal? Oh, I, I would. I was happy. Uh, it, was, it was pretty cool. And when I called him, it was uh, kind of neat that, yeah. uh, you know, he could do it at his age and, and that he, he does love our country. He represents our city uh, in our armed forces. Uh, it, one of the things, though, just to uh, ask you about this, well, part of the parade, and I, I know this goes up, I don't know if you noticed it or not, there's a billboard up right by the grocery store there. For uh, Joseph Hutchison, he was a Clear Creek High School grad who was killed in action. Did you see that at all? Did anything go through your mind? Someone gave the ultimate sacrifice. That's something uh, that we all sign up knowing that we're going to do these days. We're an all volunteer army, and, and uh, I didn't know the man personally, but uh, he's a hero to this nation. How about for yourself? Do you ever, as a, as a parent, I'm sure the worry goes through your mind. You're proud oh, sure. of him, but oh yeah. And, and I've been close to the other soldiers in the area who, who have been killed. I've been close with their families. So I, I think he represents Texas City at its best, and, and hopefully things will work out, and, and he'll come home in a year, and we can have another celebration. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Joseph, are you, you plan on making the Army a career? Or, uh... This deployment will let me know. Uh, I'm not really sure. I, I love it, uh, but I know they're also bigger and better. So this deployment will let me know, and uh, from there I'll, I'll plan out my future, just taking it a day at a time. For the for the upcoming tour you've got going to Afghanistan, when do you actually head over? Do you know yet? Um, gotcha. All right.